going to get his ribs broken. He's punching with the intensity that only Roberto Duran can punch with. Why would they want Leonard to take him inside? Leonard in trouble again. He, his knee just buckled at that right hand. But he's coming back fighting. Now this is stupid of Leonard to get stuck on the ropes with Duran belaboring him. There he's got him again. Duran ran into a right hand that was a little high. You know that Leonard is pulling an Ali? Yes, but only Ali has been able to pull an Ali. What he's taking is some body shots that are going to kill him later on. Duran getting under Leonard's shots. It's been an incredible third round, an incredible second, an incredible first. They said, could it live up to the advanced billing? Leonard might have hurt around a little bit. Look at Duran. Duran is landing 10 punches to every one for Leonard. Unless Leonard can catch him off these ropes. I don't know how he can hope to win this fight this way. Would you believe Leonard trying to match Macho with Macho? Yeah, he's been reading the papers. That's too bad. He should have been fighting from outside. Movement is what he needs. Movement. Leonard coming on good with a combination, but it didn't seem to hurt Roberto. Roberto right above us. Leonard with a furious assault to the body. Leonard throwing everything he's got into the punches. Roberto ducking under him and keeps punching, keeps coming. Angelo thinks Roberto is vulnerable in the body. Oh, let me tell you right now, Leonard's throwing hard. What a round. Third round, you're looking at Roberto Duran and Arcel exhorting him. I just turned around to look at Wilfredo Benitez. Wilfredo? What do you think? Well, I'm not going away. I will be knocking him out in two rounds, you know, because in, in my best condition, nobody can beat me. Who do you, do you think, think about this Who fight, do you think though? is winning right now? Quien gana ahora? So I, I saw, I seen the, the fight, so... Say it again. Uh, we had to get away for a moment. Who do you it's, think is winning right now, Wilfredo? It's even the fight. Even fight. Gracias. I don't see it that way at all. That was Wilfredo Benitez, a former welterweight champion, but I have Duran. Duran is surprised, Freddie, at the fact that Leonard is not running on him. Now Leonard is starting to use the left hand. Leonard must move. He must move and do what got him here. He got here by being a beautiful boxer with a great jab. For him to stay on the ropes and take all that buddy, buddy, body punishment is unnecessary. I don't know what they're trying to prove image-wise with Leonard. They don't know if they... He is reacting to every feint with the left hand. He is definitely very gun-shy. Roberto is standing right in front of him. He is not catching any jabs. There's too much distance between them right now. What surprises me is that Leonard is standing right in front of Duran. I thought he'd fight him side to side. But Leonard apparently feels he can beat him that way and beat him at his game. That's what he wants to prove. Well, he hasn't beaten him so far. Unless they wait. Oh, he just got hit on. Leonard just got hit on the break. Not hard. But it goes to show you the rope. Oh, look at that. Leonard would come out and fight as if he were fighting Pete Ranzani. I don't think that Duran has given him any choice. He's fighting the fight that Duran is commanding right now. The difference in this fight is that Duran is fighting his fight, and Sugar Ray Leonard is not. He is being forced to fight Duran's fight, which is what you're seeing right now. 
There were some who thought that a cold night would be bad for Duran. I said that he didn't have a real sweat. He's got one now as he punched himself out. Duran will never punch himself out. He hurt Leonard with that left hook. I would never have believed that they go to the pit this way. I would never have believed it of Ray because what he's doing is getting his ribs caved in. And that's going to tell later on in the fight. Ray is hoping to catch him off those ropes and unless he does, he's in trouble.
guts. He got guts. What an incredible fight. They have been exchanging evenly. All that ring experience. All of that ring experience. Right now watch this. Watch this exchange between Leonard and Duran. As they get in close, they're beginning to really pummel each other. It's beginning to be tough. What Sugar Ray Leonard put on him at the end of that round should have dropped Duran, but it didn't. And now's where we get to find out. Leonard reacts to finding out that his punch is not going to knock out Duran. We know what Duran is thinking. You know, there was a discussion at the meeting about the use of smelling salts. And originally, the boxing commission, the Montreal Boxing Commission, said no smelling salts. But both corners said we want to use them. You know why? Round number six, Leonard and Duran. Leonard has shown a lot of class in these first five rounds. Roberta has shown his animal intensity, and it has been a barn burner, and it is a pretty even fight. Oh, beautiful shot by Leonard, and caught Duran just like he did opening the other round. Hello! And, of course, the usual laugh from Duran. He's starting to suck him into that left hook again. Step forward with the left foot, draw back and bang. Incredible fight. Not what we expected at all. I figured it'd be a dancing Leonard, but he wants to beat Duran at Duran's kind of fight. Beautiful body shot by Leonard, answered by a beautiful body shot by Duran. And back on the rope. It seems that Duran is very satisfied to back him to the ropes and wail away at the body. Leonard should not be caught there. He fainted him twice, once with the left, then with the right, and tried to go with the left. Leonard now is not blinking or stepping away from the face. Leonard is, is in those close exchanges. Leonard's landing some short punches. trying to go underneath that left hand with a right uppercut to the body. But I must tell you, this has been a good round for Leonard. The referee keeps knocking down the ref. Oh, that was a great shot by Leonard. The referee tries to knock out Roberto's right hand, but never. Everybody said, 